What's going on guys? I'm back at y'all with yet another video. Um, it's not a big issue, but yet another issue. Um, so, the front right tire is leaking out of uh, the rim actually. There's, there's not like a hole in it, there's no nail. But the, the rim of the tire itself, uh, it's leaking so it's probably got a bad seal. And uh, I noticed that it was losing pressure, maybe like five psi overnight. Um, thought it was because of the cold. Um, didn't think much of it. And uh, brought it here, and they found out that there's a, a bad seal on the actual tire itself on the wheel. <sighs> Saga never ends, man. This is a never ending issue. <laughs> Underneath here. Actually looking pretty clean. So disappointed. That this is happening. This is so frustrating because it's also been raining outside for the past ten days and it just adds to the terrible mood. Never ending man, oh my god. So we shall see what's gonna happen. He's going to uh, see if he can dismount and mount it again and see what he can do. No promises, fingers crossed. We shall see. While we're here, we shall talk about my next mod. It's going to be the front plate bracket that's going to attach underneath here where these two screws are. You know, I don't want to be there all over their back, but um, you know, I don't want to bother them. I want to let them do their job. They mentioned to me that uh, this tire is way too low pro and it's super hard to work with, so... You know, I don't want to distract them, I want to let them do their job. And hopefully they can do it right. From what I, from what I saw, I don't know, man. That thing will look rough back there. <laughs> but yeah, we shall see. Unreal, man. Unreal. What a pain. Alright, they said they got some news for me. Holy shit. Bad news or? Uh, not sure what to tell you. There's a lot of grit and grime. No, that's corrosion underneath. Oh, no way. So, what do you think? Because aluminum, when they corrode, it's yeah. not like rust, they become this like powdery white stuff. Mm. But Usually, that doesn't happen when it's painted on the inside like this. Yeah. But underneath the paint, you see this. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, it's just so like all, chipping that's away. That's all aluminum corrosion. Mm. I'm surprised that that happened when, for such new wheels. But yeah, we have to, pull, we have to take all of this off. Oh, okay, that's okay. That's the reason it's uh, leaking. Oh, okay, so it's got a bad seal around it. So, we were able to figure out the issue. It was a corroding aluminum wheel that's causing an uneven seal. You now they gotta grind it all down, get it an even surface, and uh, mount the tire back again. Oh my god. I looked into this before. Um, didn't think this would be an issue. A corroding wheel, but that's what I got. My pain, your pleasure. She's filthy, man. God damn you, Mercedes. Well, it's not Mercedes' fault, but... Yeah. So the verdict was... I've got a leaky wheel, and... It's got a bit of corrosion on it. And the way aluminum corrodes, it's weird. It just 
gets this white stuff on the surface, kind of like patina or something, and uh, causes uh, an uneven seal, and you're stuck with a leaky wheel. Yep. The more you know. May y'all ever feel like messing around with this stuff? I feel like if I ever touch this, it's just gonna fall to the ground. It scares me, man. Anyways, I'll uh, wait till they're done and then I'll uh, give you guys another update with what's going on and if it's actually fixed the problem that I'm having. And um, yeah, I'll get back to you guys shortly. Peace. Alright ladies and gents, we are back from the mechanic. So they were able to figure out what was wrong with the car. So basically there was uh, corrosion on the rim of the wheel, the inner uh, rim of the wheel. Um, aluminum corrosion, uh, go figure. And uh, so it was kind of like developing like this white patina type like gathering there. It was like little raised spots um, that was basically causing a uh, an uneven seal. And it was causing the wheel to uh, leak very slowly, like about five or six PSI overnight. And um, so yeah, they basically uh, resurfaced the wheel and they were able to uh, save it. At first they thought they might not have uh, been able to get it done because it was, um, it's a very low profile tire. They don't want to, you know, damage anything and, you know, the machine they were using, they said sometimes it gets stuck or something like that. I don't know what they were trying to say, but they're saying it's it's a bit of a, a pain in your butthole. You know what I'm saying? So, we're all good now. Um, you know, that where it says 37 PSI for uh, the far left, which is the front right tire, um, that was reading 26 and, uh, you know, I was there parked for a while, came back in, still reading 37, so, you know, that's how we know we're all fixed up and good to go. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed uh, my stressful time, and uh, I will uh, be back at y'all with another video. As always, I do appreciate you guys tuning in. Please like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff, and, uh, I'll be back to y'all with the next saga. Peace.